There's about 70 quarts so far, Mayor. 70? We need at least 30 more. But that's almost half. Edane, dear, you know the festivities can't begin otherwise. There's still an entire day left. You'll manage. Yes, Mayor. <laughs> New shipment just arrived from aspiring... No. I didn't even ask anything. There's only one thing you men think about, and the answer is no. I have work to do. Don't bother me. Is that how you welcome people? I don't know you from an orc. Just mind your business and your manners. Damned outsiders always bring trouble. Listen, I'm looking for someone. Good. Look somewhere else and leave me be, outsider. Stay in Dorchid, explore the town, spend some coin if you like. Now sorry, but I'm busy. Good day. Listen, I'm looking for a friend of mine. She's unusual looking and she always wears a veil. Ah, uh, yes, I saw her a couple of days back. She definitely looked foreign, but at least she wasn't a Tersian. That's her. Where is she? Who can say? She said she was just passing through. I assume that's what she did. Perhaps she spoke to someone else in the village. I have to find her. And I have to take care of my village. Best of luck to both of us. My village is obliged to you, even though the animal did follow you here. You're blaming me? Not at all. If the beast avoided the traps, it would have come here eventually. You've done my people a service. Let me know if I can do one for you. I just need to know everything that masked woman told you. I'm afraid there wasn't much. She said she had business north of our village, and she went there. Damn. Well, someone on this island hired her to find the people who disappeared, or those responsible for the kidnappings. There have been disappearances, but I certainly haven't hired anyone to investigate. All I know is that your friend bought some supplies and went north. You know, there are some merchant outposts and a migrant camp further to the north. Darius said the merchants have had some trouble with the vagabonds lately. Maybe they hired her. But if some tersion from the migrant camp hired your friend, I bet Tanoras she won't see a broken track. All they know is scamming, stealing, and killing each other. So the merchant outposts in the camp are north of here? Yes, in the northern ravages. Perhaps Jethro at the shop or someone at the inn will know more. But I'm sure she headed that way. You don't seem very trustful of people. I'm trying to run this place and protect my people. It doesn't pay to be trusting, especially of strangers. And with all that's been happening... Like what? Strange sounds in the mountains, disappearances, damn Tersians. What's with all the work going on around town? You all seem pretty busy. 
You have a gift for understatement, friend. The day of all crops is approaching, and we're short on time, men, and resources. We're reusing so much old equipment, it'll be a wonder if we pull it off. Still, we do our best. What makes you so sure it's the Tertians? Who else would it be? My people, the people raised in Dorchid, are good, upstanding folk. Those Tertians, they're nothing but roaches infesting our island. If the Tertians are so hated, what are they doing here? Some bloody civil war in the south, but that's nothing new. I could give a damn if they wipe each other out, as long as they do it elsewhere. Uh, yet somehow they thrive, and after their ship crashed here, they've crawled across our island like a plague. I'd better get going, Mayor. I should be getting back to work myself. Look over our bulletin board if you'd like. We post things that may interest a man like you. Oh, and the girl you saved, Dane, wants to have a word with you. Best of luck finding your friend. Thank you. Come on, come on, come big, come small, come once and come twice. Best of luck finding your friend. Thank you. New shipment just arrived from aspiring young craftsmen. Don't get. Design.
Help! Over here, help! Help us! Please! What the hell is going on here? Thugs! Bandits! I'm Matthias the Merchant! Everyone knows me! They beat us, took our money, our merchandise, then they just left us here for the wolves! Please, cut us free! Alright, hold on. Thank you. I don't know what we would have done if you hadn't have showed up. You won't be sorry. Our friends have money and they should be searching for us right now. Use that horn over there and they'll come running. All right. Come on, cut it. Yes, they must have heard us. Here, cut us free. Come on, cut it. What are these freakish things? Try asking. You can talk? Probably. More languages than you. You're welcome for the help, by the way. Well, are you alright? Yes, smart boy. There's just this wound the size of your head. Come on. Help me get to my hut and my herbs.
You sure this will help you? It looks like paint. And smells like fungus. It is fungus. Epicor tea. Brewed from mygospores. Its healing powers are like no other. It's almost empty, though. I'll brew more while we talk. I'll be fine, as long as I avoid getting exhausted again. I guess you know what you're doing. It certainly beats bleeding out. Hold on. I think it's starting to work. Better. But not by much. It should give me enough energy to brew some fresh hippocore. Here, hand me that bowl with the spores. What's this? It's right there on the on the table. It's right there on the on the table. Here you go. Empty. What else can go wrong? I need herbs from the cemetery. Beginning to think I should have stayed out of this. All right, rat. Just what are you? If you can't mind your own safety, at least mind your pronouns. All right. Who are you? Ah, better. My name is Orias. Come, let's speak in the garden. I'll need a moment's rest before I go search out more Hepacor. You can tell me what you did to those men to make them so disagreeable. I should apologize. I appreciate the help back there. You just... You look a lot like someone else. I must resemble many people you know. Cute. What I mean is, I've been hunting creatures that look like you, only they're from the past. Or are we from my present? Gods be damned, this is confusing. You are conversing with a talking rat. Good point. I came here last night to meet with an old friend. When I arrived, I saw a group of rat creatures attack her. One of them looked like he was partly made of metal. He seemed to be their leader. I know the one you speak of. It's a wonder you survived. Few who meet him do. I am sorry they killed your friend. I'm not sure she's dead. There was some kind of magical barrier and some kind of, of portal. I know this sounds crazy, but I think what happened to Darfa hasn't happened yet. Not in this time, at least. What? What do you mean? I said it wouldn't make sense. No. Tell me everything. And I was just feet away from her when it happened. I saw her on the ground, and those things, the stone pillars, they looked different. They looked active. Then he did it. He actually found it. And it's only days away from now. No more than a week. You mean, you understand all this? It's Adramelic. He found a way to open the time tunnels. He's activated the portals. The dormant ones. And who knows how many more. Gods, he must be ready to strike. What portals? Who are you talking about? And what does any of this have to do with Darfa? Ah! Oh. Arias. Pain. I... I must rest. What's wrong? I can't. Too much at once. Need my hepacore. Arias, talk to me. Adramelli, he wants to... Oh, get me spores. Hepacore, in the cemetery. What cemetery? Where? Notes on the table. In the hut, read the notes. Rest.
said in warning. Always seems to be a few more of you to get.
me. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 